Capital Gains Tax or CGT is a tax that is paid when you sell an investment or asset for more than it costs you to acquire it. For example, you may be liable for capital gains tax if you sell shares, property, a banana ice cream business, bitcoin or a contract for more than it costs you to buy it. Capital gains tax is different from income tax, but they are both paid in your yearly tax return. For example, Georgia buys a parcel of shares in a bank for $1,000 and sells them for $1,500 just six months later. That's a capital gain of $500 or $1,500 minus $1,000. Georgia also receives dividend income of $100. Georgia will pay taxes on $600 in total. That is, she will pay taxes on both the dividend income of $100 and the increase in the value of her shares, which was $500. If Georgia's marginal tax rate is 20%, she will pay $120 in tax for her investment, or 20% multiplied by $600. Individuals can claim a capital gains tax discount for owning an investment for more than one year. For example, Georgia would pay tax on only half of her capital gain if she owned the bank shares for more than one year. For some assets, you won't be liable to pay capital gains tax. For example, capital gains made on the family home or a car that was used for personal reasons only. However, if you use your house as a home office or workshop, or use your car to make money, like driving for Uber, you will be liable to pay some capital gains tax when you sell. It's always a good idea to check with your accountant if you're worried about paying a large tax bill.